Hola, hola. Okay. Hello. Guys, I got trapped. Venga, come on. Oh no, she's taking me. Where are we going? Where are we going? Nate, in your state. All right, guys, I'm gonna try out China House here for the first time. Let's go ahead and go, cause I'm a big fan, an advocate of Chinese food. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, bro. That's what I said. You got the all the Asian people here. And I'm telling you, man, there's a whole lot of them up inside. Interiorly, I like the design of how it looks. It's pretty cool. It reminds me of like a legit dim sum Chinese food spots. I am number six. Um, I gotta say, I like Chinese food. And look, there goes the Chinese Costa Ricans. They're leaving. So, we are, we're gonna get some food up in this piece. When I go get the local food, the rice wasn't there, fam. I don't know, man, they, they can't do the rice right. So I would prefer rice made by either the Chinese or rice made by the, uh, which is gracias. Rice made by the Chinese or rice made by the Jamaicans, man. If you want real Jamaican Caribbean cuisine, you have to go to like Puerto Viejo and beyond. From my observation, over there and you go all the way further towards Panama, yeah, it's like the quality of rice, it starts to slap. The quality of Caribbean food starts to slap. Costa Rican Chinese food, man. I kid you not, man. It slaps over here. It really does slap. Ah, uh, yeah. Look, look at this, man. Oh, man. I'm, I'm telling you. I say this once. I want to say it again, man. Costa Rica. Look at me, right? Costa Rica might as well be the United States of Central America, man. <laughs> Yo, all walks of life are over here. Everybody's over here. Super laid back, super chill, and we got Chinese food that slaps because they use the ingredients of the land. Get what I'm saying? But I mean, I got I got Chinese vegetables, of course. But yeah, you know, this is good. How much is gracias? I'm a little bit woozy. Drank that Smirnoff, and I drank it without eating first. So I'm feeling kind of like a little eye-ish, a little exhausted, a little tired from that. <laughs> But I'm um, getting ready to go through the rest of this day because I want to go check out that other mall on the other side of town. And I want you guys to follow me as I go over there, okay? So, yeah, you already know. It's always an adventure up in here. All right? Sassy. <laughs> What's going on, y'all? This is Nate from Nate Your State. Back at you with another video, and I'm in Floti Plaza, Escasu. As I should have been recording here earlier though but i'm trying to get inside before my non-waterproof handset gets all messed up and we're here to explore as we always do you know what i'm saying that's what we do here it ain't in your state okay so this mall honestly uh, from first impressions based off of the outside is a whole lot bigger than what i'd see than the um the other multi plaza there's mad people here too. Like we're about to see what we can get ourselves into as we exploring over here and a whole loads of people. Oh, I'm already late. Places are already closing. But it's all cool. So I'm guessing like upstairs is the food court. Of course, food is definitely important. So we're gonna see what food they got before we uh, see what else is in this mall before everything pulls up. Yeah, so far so good. I can't even, can't even complain. The reason why I like it because it's like, it's close to the airport. So let's say you're waiting for your Airbnb to open up and you just need some time to kill. This would be one of the spots as they got most of the same things that I'm remem I remember seeing. We got out the way first. Just like the other one, they got all of the same things like I remember seeing KFC, Hungry, Quiznos, McDonald's. It's pretty much all the same things when it comes to like cuisine. And I remember that's the taco spot. But yeah, this, not as big as I would say the other one, I can't even pronounce. But yeah, we're just going to keep it moving because it's practically the same. It's just a smaller space. Feel me? And I'm trying to figure out what's left on me. All right, cool. It seems like there's multiple floors here. And yeah, the movie theaters, the movie theaters. 
Yeah. You can always smell that popcorn from a mile away. And there's an Auntie Anne's. Auntie Anne's, what are you doing here? You crossed the globe just to come over here? But I mean, it's respectful, you know? Auntie Anne's always brings up a line of people as just like, you know, it doesn't smell like Auntie Anne's because there's no scent. Usually that's what, that's their driving factor. That's usually their driving factor. Auntie Anne's cinnamon smell and all that luscious things that we got. So what, what we got here? So we got Rambo Pura Vida and we got a, a jewelry shop. All right. I gotta hold on, hold on. We're, we're gonna have to do. I'm gonna have to zoom this out just a little bit, just so I can get. Wonder what's going on over there. Hold on, let me let me zoom this out a bit. Cool, much better. Now we can capture the stuff that we want to capture, right? Um, cool. So we got a Calvin Klein, and oh, I, I can already tell that I'm gonna get lost here, guys. I don't even know where to start. So we're gonna go in the direction where we see the Zaro while we look at them. Um, Honor, Magic Five. So this is their star case. I do, Puerto Vida. Okay, make sure you get that. So I'm guessing that will be like their star case phone over here, but I'm pretty sure I've seen iPhones and stuff over here. I wouldn't, wouldn't know for sure because I haven't seen their phones. You know what I'm saying? I haven't really talked to no one. Hola, hola. Okay. Hello. <laughs> okay, all right. Hola. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, selfie. Hold on, let me put on the selfie. Selfie's here. All right, all right. Hola. <laughs> okay. Can I just say algo? No? Venga. Oh, no. Here we go. All right. Venga. Pero no entiendo mucho español. English. English. Traducho. Oh, my. All right. Let's see. Los Estados Unidos. See? Guys, I'm gonna get in trouble. Face shop. Face shop. Venga, come on. Oh no, she's taking me. Where are we going? Where are we going? Uh oh. Uh oh. Sit down, please. One moment. Okay. But uh, oh, all right. Here we go. Let's let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Sí. ¿Puedes salir en YouTube? Sí. ¿Lo ves el famoso? Tienes que uh, suscribirte. ¿Cómo se llama? Suscribirte. ¿Qué está haciendo acá en Costa Rica? ¿Qué está haciendo en Costa Rica? ¿Qué está haciendo? Solo, solo graba video. ¿Viajar? ¿Viajar? Sí. ¿Conocer? Sí, 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 sí. Por eso estaba en Limón. Eh, Puerto Viejo, sí, sí. Puerto Viejo. Sí, sí, Puerto Viejo, sí. All the other places, sí. Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We gotta, we gotta. Guys, I got trapped. La sesión facial. Here we go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ay, ahora sí me voy. All right, let's, let's keep this moving, man. Let's keep. Which is gracias, mi amor. Adios. Ciao, ciao, ciao. Ciao, ciao. All right, cool. Now, let's get back to regular schedule programming. I got a little <laughs> distracted. Okay. All right. Cool. Let's see now. Oh, that's funny, man. You guys are funny. Let's, let's get it. All right, so we have... What else do we have here? Oh, I gotta get my camera centered. We're good. See, this is what I mean how I get lost. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't know. I start walking and I go down a path and then I get lost just by looking at stuff. Oh, I probably should have told them, nah, we're good. That's fine. They probably, if I tell them, if I tell them, <laughs> if I give them my car, they probably may want me to uh, buy something. And uh, we're just chilling at the moment. All right, so we're here at the center. Now automatically lost, because I just met so many turns and stuff. There's the Samson, and there's this area. Smart zone just locked up. But, sheesh, okay guys, I'm checking my pockets. I got everything. 
All right. Cool. What do we have here? Innovations. Okay. Stuff. I, I, I like that. Travel stuff. So if you're looking for travel supplies, they got it here in this mall too. And there goes the supermarket. So I guess this would be my point to like turn and like continue going on. Cool. Clubhouse, the hat spot. So there's a supermarket and then there's a manga shop. See? Now the nerd side is going to make me ignore exploring everything and just going in there to like indulge into what I like. And this is pretty much nerd anime stuff concept that they got over here but i know if i go inside i probably won't leave so i'm just going to do it from the outside looking in and if they call me in then, then i probably go in there though but it's the anime shop I always have to check that out before i go in there okay moving along moving along we got i think i could get that i'm not sure if i've seen a shop like this in the states this looks familiar but i'm not 100 percent sure Okay, all right, so now, me being lost, where the heck am I? I think I started over there and I'll continue walk. Because they're having the video games over here, too. Okay. Oh, okay, so that is more of like another exit entrance area. All right, cool. So, we'll continue onward this way. I'm telling you, if you see one of those, you kind of know what you're dealing with in terms of like money. All right? You gotta have money to really have one of these in like your neighborhood. So, they're there. Zara is also here as well. Along with a Forever 21. All these American brands are brands that I've seen in America a lot. <laughs> and of course, gotta have a Starbucks, right? Wouldn't be a mall unless you had your Starbucks. Can you guys see that? Uh, I'll get closer. But why is there a Nissan shop down there? Okay, we'll, we'll check that out when we go do our rounds again to figure out why there's a Nissan over there. But, um, yeah, what's up with this phone? I wonder why everybody, why they're advertising it. Might be their phone of choice. I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? Okay. So everybody here in this mall is... <laughs> I'm accidentally giving everybody free advertisements, but it is what it is when we come to this mall. Okay. All right, all right. So there's a, there's, where the heck is Starbucks? All right, so here we are. This is another entrance exit area. And we are about to go downstairs because I think I reached the other end. Yeah. There's Starbucks over here. And they got a line. And they got a line. Okay. So Starbucks still selling now. No matter where you are. Okay, I, I think I remember a tech shop like this. No matter where you are, Starbucks is still selling now. Okay. All right. Uh, bathroom Body Works. That is awesome. Cool. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, Universal, okay. All right, let's go downstairs now and see what we could find. <sighs> let's let you know it's the mall. Escalator don't work. Okay. All right. See, one thing I would have to point out, compared to my last mall videos that I did in Colombia, um, I'm getting a little bit more confident just talking to the camera, and I really do appreciate me having confidence not only that it's relatively safe here in uh costa rica so one they're not hassling me down telling me turn off the camera and two you know no one i'm not really afraid of anybody trying to scoop my stuff while i'm recording so okay so we're going to keep on moving around this way because uh that was a pet shop and we're gonna see what else they got over here it's, doors are starting to close i am here a little late um in the evening it's a sunday evening we are looking at what is the weather i want to put all that information up before but 
Yeah, I'm going to put all of that information up before, but I'll let you know. But it's a Sunday evening, just, just a heads up. And we just passed the Nordica. There's a at St. Jack's Pharmacy. What is this? You guys don't want to look at me. All right? Go for it. <laughs> go for it. Go for it. Go for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Say what's up. Yeah, yeah. All right, cool. All right. So we're talking about Everlasters over here. All right. Everybody saying what's up. We, we, we keep it moving like that. Okay. And a fusion shop. Cool, 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 cool. All right, all right. Panda. Man, there is a lot of stuff here, guys. So now, hold up. So now we're getting to one of my biggest questions. We got a big old dog here. So why is there a Nissan here? We move back, right? I'm very curious. Oh, okay. But I'm like, come on now. You, you can't drive this out the shop, but there's a transfer zone from the outside to over here. Okay. All right. Cool. And that's another thing I've noticed. Like, everybody got their dogs here. There's another poodle behind me. There's the husky right there. And um, there's a pet shop behind me as well. Stuff is here. Okay. Two floors of Forever 21. There's another one upstairs. You guys already know. Um, and then we're looping around. I think I got lost somewhere over here. And I really didn't get time to like survey the rest of the area. But I think eventually I'm going to get back to where I was once before. Once I find out where I'm going, y'all. So we're going to keep it going. And then we'll figure out where we are here in this gigantic Mecca Plaza Mall. All right. Cool. <laughs> Guys, I'm like mad out of place. Got my Tim's on, the big black dude just walking around with the camera. Okay. But because of Sunday, y'all, um, a lot of people aren't working and like uh, businesses and whatnot, it's, they take the day off. The same like I remember in Jamaica. Um, Sunday, after Sunday, it's completely like dead in the streets. But San Jose, you know, the malls are open, people's out and about. So I guess that's probably, probably a reason why there's like so many heads out here. But nevertheless, man, um, you guys get to see more or less the people of Costa Rica on a Sunday out here at the mall. And you guys can't say that I don't show y'all nothing. All right. So that's the parking lot. Cats, Caterpillar, Caterpillar Boots. I'm surprised I haven't even seen a Timberland store yet. You get what I'm saying? Nice. Okay. So it's more or less more of the same things that I've seen in the other one down by the southeast. <laughs> I'm, I will butcher that name. I'm not even going to attempt to say it, but it starts with a C. Multi Plaza C, as I'll call it, because I'll mess that up. I've been even messing up the name of this ones too, right? I've been messing up the names. See, Pokemon stuff is getting me a little excited. Yeah, so I've been messing up the names of uh, this one too. This one is what? S, S, -S, 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 -S Q B S B. I don't know the name of this one. I want to remember it probably once I'm done with this video. Mm. An ice cream station. That's really nice. And a McDonald's pastry station. That, uh, and a McDonald's ice cream section for those who just want ice cream at a McDonald's and don't want anything extra. It's right there. A working ice cream machine. So there's a candy shop or a Playland shop for children over there. If you have kids and you want to leave them, you can bring them to Candy Play. There is a gym. Of course, Amazon has their own gym, Smart Fit. There is Walmart here, and then there is a department of Walmart specifically for Costa Rica. 
um, called Maxi Pally. Like that shop. Didn't have time to go there to like scoop up some like candy before I dip. But um, yeah, I answered my own question. Said so they do have like iPhones and other good stuff here. So I was wondering why they keep ad advertising that magic one. When they got iPhones. But okay, I mean, I guess it might be a budget phone. And guys, there's another floor. Okay, so three floors. Okay, so we're gonna, work our, we're gonna make our way down there eventually as I see what's down here on this bottom floor. You know, just never know. There's a bathroom over there. So the Columbia brand is here as well. So that means Columbia. The Columbia brand is making money. Not to be confused with the uh, country that a lot of people seem to misspell. They misspell the country wrong, but that's the brand. <laughs> so Victoria's Secret has been going out of business and it's surprising to see that they're over here. And uh, do I see, I don't, I don't, I see workers, but I don't really see people in there per se. <laughs> American Eagles, bro. They got, they got, they got a, quite the customer base over there. So from what I'm looking, from the outside looking in, well, I hope brother is there with his girlfriend. <laughs> He's the only dude that I see up in the, you know what I'm saying? All right. <laughs> Here we go. Um, Sunglass Hut, which I also seen in the States. Mac, I also saw that in the States. Um, so I think I've reached the other end, but I haven't really been upstairs on the other end because there's a North Face over there. Mini, Mini Sue as well. These are like these mega brands that you see all over the place, man. So if it's here international, then yeah, it is what it is. Exit, Crocs. Crocs got their own shop. This store got two, two floors. I wonder what that's about. But Adidas, Reebok, um, what else have I seen? Crocs, Adidas, Reebok, Crocs. These guys are here. These guys are here, so I want to check the bottom, bottom floor. And I think this is cool. Is this a map display of where we are? That would be awesome if this is really what it is, what it is, and we're here. Okay, cool. Crocs, man, I'm telling you, you can't go anywhere without Crocs. Those Crocs, it's plus. All right, so we're ready to go downstairs. Wait, do I need to go upstairs? Tiffany and Company, Paulo, Ralph Lauren. I think we're good. I don't think we need to go upstairs. And Carolina Herrera, these guys. These guys are all here. All right, so we're gonna go downstairs and explore the bottom floor, see what else they got. Uh, there we go. Gotta force this camera to really go up. Instead of like staring at people, man, making it look odd, mad awkward. What's up? Oh, no, puedo por nada. No? Pero solo yo? A usted si, las tiendas no. Ah, no tiendas. Okay, so solo me. Alright, so here we go. So, just like Colombia, you can't, they don't want you to record the stores, but. When it comes to yourself, there's some loopholes that we can do. You know what I'm saying? Let's go. So, as I'm going along, we're going to explain to it. So that way, if there's any issues, we can, you know, let you know what's up. So, there's a spoon. This place called Spoon. And I've seen it around. It's like a pastry, sort of bakery sort of a thing. And... From this, from what I see, this bottom floor is all about, it's all about like bakeries, pastries, and all that other good stuff. You feel me? So, just letting you know that it is here. McDonald's, McCafe, Spoon, and an exit. <sighs> Doing it by the book so you guys can, can sort of kind of see. You know what I'm saying? So, alright. So, just like Colombia, I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. You guys will probably have to let me know what's the issue in terms of like recording in malls and like different places. You guys would have to definitely let me know. If you guys let me know, let me know in the comments. 
But nevertheless, we still want to keep the show going, right? So, when it comes to, I guess, mega stuff like electronics, Radio Shack is here, and I thought that maybe Radio Shack would be out of business as it is right behind me. You know what I'm saying? DJI is also here as well. So, it lets you know that all the vloggers, all the camera people, all the people that does the filming and content creators can get the work though going. It's empty. I mean, reason being because I know it's very costly, but it's right next to me. Okay? Um, honestly, I think I've seen it all. To be perfectly honest, as I'm here, I think I've seen it all. I Because then the escalators is right in front of me. There isn't no additional other portion, right? And then the banks are over there, Under Armour, or Under Armour is here, and yeah, then you go to the exit. So I'm going to just post up and just give you guys my closing notes. All right, here's my closing notes. We post up somewhere. It's very, it takes me out of the solo American mindset where in the United States of America, New York, you only see, or even like, yeah, within the United States, you only see the same malls, particular malls. This is what we're used to. So when it comes to mega malls elsewhere, I wasn't expecting to see so much other things, but then again, I shouldn't be too surprised when I went to one of the biggest malls in Bogota. When I was in Bogota, I got to see the big malls with all the other big stuff, and eventually you guys want to see that if you haven't seen it already. That episode is going to be there. I'll probably post it somewhere around so you guys can see the mall stuff. But yeah, there's a lot of folks up in here, and I think it's relatively cool to see people out and about. It, it lets you know, okay, this is another version of the culture within the country that I'm in. Once again, I, I still have to figure out the reason why you can't record within a mall and stuff and all that good stuff. But I did get some good footage. I did get some pictures. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to leave you guys high and dry. And you guys got to see before the ending of this video, all right? So if you haven't done so already, please like, comment, and subscribe. If you, look, if you guys think I'm worth the subscription, go for it. If you like, yo, who is this bald mofo? Why is he asking for a subscription? I ain't gonna give it to him. I'm cool with that too. If you even made it this far and watching it, I'm very surprised. So once again, big up to y'all. Thank you so much for watching this video. What do you think about the mall's hair? I mean, I've been to two of them so far. Is there another mall that you want me to check out? What do you recommend? Let me know in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching this video. Keep eating, keep exploring. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Nate in your state.